here in the English department. We're very excited about the changes that we've made in the mid-year exam. All of our students in grades 9 through 11 will be presenting an oral presentation about the thematic connections between what they've read in class and depending on the grade level, 9, 10, or 11, perhaps an outside text as well. We think that this is going to be a much more authentic assessment in terms of asking students to think both specifically about what they've been reading as well as in broader terms and making big world and real world connections. Because of this change in the exam format, the exam in English for first semester will only be 10% of the grade instead of 20% because we feel like when you make this sort of significant change, we want to give it a year to make sure that we've dotted all our I's and crossed all our T's, so to speak. So it will be 10% instead of 20% of a student's grade. I think it will also be an opportunity for students to be creative because they're going to be asked to either put together a PowerPoint or a Prezi, make some sort of presentation with slides. Um, they'll have the opportunity to stand in front of their peers and be animated and ask questions and make comments um, that we hope will really be thought-provoking for the audience, which of course will be uh, their classmates. So we feel good about it. I'm excited about seeing what my students come up with and I wish everybody the best in preparing their English exam um, in January. Doing alternate assessments and so we thought uh, as we talked as a department um, that there were uh, this speech requirement now at Ravenscroft and uh, some opportunities for students to work on some of those public speaking skills uh, would be a, a good thing and that we could test some of the same English skills that we're looking at through writing uh, in terms of finding uh, comparisons between texts and making connections outside the text uh, and give students a different opportunity to uh, to prepare in, in, in that regard to, to speak and, and prepare a presentation uh, that might be a little bit more, I don't know, interesting and, and fun and different. Uh, we felt like there were a lot of great benefits for it in terms of um, breaking up the uh, exam schedule a little bit so students have a little bit more time to focus on other exams and, and we could uh, do this in, in January instead. So it seemed like a good fit that would benefit students as well as hitting those different um, different uh, skills that we wanted them to have an opportunity to exercise. So that's kind of the idea of it. Uh, this year is really the pilot of it and hopefully it will go well and we'll see if uh, if it's something that should uh, we should continue or, or that we'll you know try a different method or or you know go back to the traditional exam. We'll, we'll have students give us some feedback afterwards and things and and go from there. But yeah that's the hope is that it's a, a meaningful experience for the students and um, helps prepare them for some of the, the skills that are, are pretty important now in the 21st century in, in, order, in terms of being able to communicate well and, and present yourself uh, in, in a lot of different regards other than just through written expression, which I'm not doing well right now, but yeah. there you go. Um, it's going to take a lot of stress out of the week forward with exams, and it's going to give us an extra study day.